general public, it doesn't make sense to wear a mask on the subway or walking on the street. to see you here again good morning uh, do you like my first video last night to upload it uh, hopefully we can share something at this moment really serious moment a period of time in our lives especially for myself and strictly speaking I have had my own self isolating months longer than a month uh, since when I watched the news, the news about China, Wuhan has been locked down uh, since the 23rd of January. Ah, uh, it's really terrified. But life is going on. Um, I have been my garden. I did some gardening uh, for one and a half hours. I'm really tired and have some drink. <laughs> the funny thing is, like this morning, I asked my husband, I said, I need a tool, I need to gather in the last autumn's old leaves from the front garden. Where is the tool? The tool is like a, a five fingers one. <laughs> it's called a rake. And I said, that's not good writing. This R looks like a T or R or, or P or pick, pack, rack. So difficult after being more than 18 years have been living here the English sometimes to got me and today I'll show you the two pack of shoppings I have bought them um, quite two weeks ago two weeks ago from Amazon I'm not quite feeling guilty about this but there's only 10 of this just in case for if I'm going to London, if I'm going to a concert or very crowded supermarket, I think it's, it helps. And I'll mention in my last video, I said this really seriously, um, a lot of cases, they don't have any symptoms. There's no cough, no sneezing, no runny nose and um, no temperature. But unfortunately, the virus itself still spread. It's quite um, potentially contagious, right? Okay, um, I wish I wear them definitely. But the funny thing is, I'll show you this time. Uh, lots of people really don't wear them properly, unfortunately, because we saw, especially from North Italian, and the guys wearing like this. This definitely doesn't help. Or roughly wearing like that, but they didn't do the nose part. You have to seal here. It's very secured. Yeah, can't hear me? Okay, can't hear me, that's okay. Um, so because this is this sort of bent part, the bent part is very important. You have to very secured press into the shape of your nose on the two sides and make sure the strain is tight enough. In another video, in my Chinese version of the videos about the first mask I, I was wearing, there's the only one in my house before I shopped those. My followers uh, wrote comments says, no, you should wear another way around. And some people says, no, you should wear the blue side out and just really seriously we need to wearing them properly but for me it's easy i just look at the straps that definitely is facing yourself and put on the ears um so the main part is very important is this part i have to clearly track it on on the nose Strictly speaking, this is not quite because the sides as well. But somehow we need to touch the strap a little bit to make it tighter, more secured. So 
that's the one thing. And a 95, a 95 is really good one. And uh, I bought 20 of them, but I believe my family, none of them want to wear them now at all. And uh, apparently that's the, for the nose part. This is a metal strength can keep on your nose. The more important thing, just wearing them properly. That's the very, very, very key thing. Otherwise, no point to wear it. Um, I hope I don't use them, probably just for my husband to do some DIY for the house in the future. Uh, but at least I'm feeling that sort of secure. Uh, keep some in my house. This I bought them really two weeks ago. I'm not feeling that guilty because um, for any sense uh, we need to protect ourselves and in case we, we're not 100% sure we have got this virus ourselves. So when you're going to a crowd of people, you met uh, lots of friends and um, maybe it's very necessary to wear one of this. Okay, that's about the mask. And another thing I really would like to share with you about the protecting um, part of the information is about Taiwan because so far we all agreed from all this um, news and the, all the information I have been watched as I knew Taiwan is the best. Why? You may ask why. Why is the best? Because since um, month ago, month and a half, one and a half month ago, uh, Taiwan has this whole, nearly whole island, whole nation of protecting action. Uh, it's like they report this, the news every day. They have a special uh, first aid association telling every single details and how many cases they have, how many people died, but so far so good. They have now have 45 cases and only one person died. Um, Comparatively speaking with Italian um, now, that sadly we all knew is over 10,000 cases has been, the people has been affected and uh, 300, more than 300 people died. Uh, this is a really tragedy for the people who lost their loving ones. Mm, they lost, this is lots of reasons why Taiwan doing so well. Uh, they said there's a part of the reason is uh, really, you know, WHO, the World Health Association, um, successfully followed Chinese uh, a community parties, we say the CCP, this sort of and the table deal, uh, they kept Taiwan as a, a member of this WHO. Uh, somehow, Taiwan government, they caught the best news, the, the, the update news, the earliest news as possible, uh, as not get the information through WHO, like um, North Korea or Italy. Italian government. Um, so somehow it is the the worst and now it's the best. Um, that's the first first word is that the, 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 they don't really follow any uh, WHO's information and then secondly uh, yesterday they, they paid one billion um, US dollars for a, a mask machine to import it to Taiwan to produce more. Um, and they have isolations, uh, the, the sessions, the doctors, the whole following service, they're doing all this, the best as we can tell. So uh, lucky Taiwan people, lucky them. Um, another thing I want to say, uh, it's really feeling funny of this because in the UK, uh, if you say wearing mask, what? 
Pardon? All the people just respond like this. Why do I need a mask? But in Hong Kong, in Taiwan, in Hong Kong, those a long queue, miles long, people queuing in for a mask to, to, to pay to buy it. And seriously, they do uh, spread to each other if you're close to them or even in the air, this really can stay for 15 seconds, really, if unlucky, you really can got it. Um, so that's in Asian country. That's, I believe this, it doesn't matter which country that I believe the virus is the same, very aggressive, very uh, tricky. They can survive on the, the hard formed table. Uh, can stay on your hands and even the the, the sole of your shoes. Uh, so in China, they have so many uh, residents went out for a little shopping and came back have to seriously spray a lot of uh, uh, what's called the sati sati sizer satiny sizer to spray on their shoes and. Uh, the hands definitely wash seriously and through the mask. They said, yeah, it's another thing is about the mask. When you take them off after you use them, you not touch the front, especially your mouth area, no nose area. You don't touch there and just get them gently get off of your face and drop it or in a plastic bag. And that's the, the last thing I've forgotten to mention. So, uh, yeah, um, that's all I can share today. In the Western country and uh, you, the, the Asian country, not because of the culture, because of the situation, they have lots, lots of people have been died, especially in China. All the, the big cities, Shanghai, Beijing, Hubei, Liaoning, there are many um, big cities and provinces has been on lockdown, like now, like Italy, this, this country's situation. So the case is really serious. It's not uh, what we expect. It's, it's not following our mind because all oh, we are confident, confident when we're facing the virus, it really doesn't help. Um, lots of experts or some of the doctors says, yeah, we don't need mask. We, we just save them for the nurse or doctors. But I would say, excuse me, no. Uh, I really strongly uh, suggest when you're going to a crowd of people, please wear them um, for the very necessarily protecting yourself first of all and that's how Taiwan Taiwan is the best of all in this we say this sort of global epidemic that's really happening uh, because month ago I thought it's far away from me is nothing with me uh, because it was thousands of miles away from China but now just my next door because first cases from UK is really close to our area. But anyway, um, catch more information as you can and um, talk to the people as you can. But for me, uh, my family don't like talk about this very much, but I constantly talking to my children months ago. Uh, let them be aware and what the situation can be. At least we knew what's happening in the world, but now we just look at conscious, not panicking, but it's just sort of conscious uh, for the good sake of our, all the lives in the UK. So ah, that's all I like to share today and uh, help you have a lovely, safe day and talk to you next time. Thank you for your watching. Bye.